Yeah. Where are all the workers? The overseer was supposed. You there? Do you work here? As a notary for the Kwama Consortium of Necrom, I demand that you explain why production has halted. Are you aware of the irreparable harm this is inflicting on our image? The Consortium will be none too pleased. Apologies, Traveler. I came on a little strong there. I'm an auditor sent to inspect Anchor Eggmine. It's been a few days since their last shipment, and the higher-ups are growing restless. Please, this isn't the first workers' strike I've negotiated. Wait, you don't think something dangerous happened here, do you? Well, I have expense funds for this assignment. Might I hire you as a bodyguard while I perform my audit? I'm required to inform you that as a contractor for the Kwama Consortium, you are held to the highest standards of conduct. But on a personal note, thank you. Now, we'll need to inspect the pens, speak with the Overseer, and take note of the Queen. It's routine, really. Whenever the Consortium believes a mine is operating below standards, they send along an auditor to run an inspection. This usually entails the Overseer providing a comprehensive tour of the Kwama pens and the mine's Queen. Olfengar. I've met him once before, back when the mine was first opened. Nordfellow. Tough as rocks and sweet as salt, but a hard worker. You want that in an overseer. To be honest, I'm surprised he's late. It's definitely out of the ordinary. I haven't the faintest idea. I was only sent along to conduct an audit, though the consortium did seem rather on edge. They said I should expect to hear all sorts of excuses, from cave-ins to cultists. <laughs> Laughable, I know, but it's part of the job. I shouldn't jump to conclusions, especially when I haven't had the chance to assess anything yet. But, yes, my employers certainly seem to think so. After all, not every worker keeps their company's best interests in mind. Oh yes, a healthy Kwama Queen is as good as gold around here. Their eggs are a staple food for Dark Elves. The Consortium outfits these mines with the best tools and workers money can buy. The Kwama Consortium of Necrom oversees the care and husbandry of egg mines on the peninsula. Their export of eggs is second to none, but even one mine operating below expectations can lead to grumbles among shareholders. Myself and others like me, yes, auditors, adjusters if you will, we assess the egg mines to ensure they continue to meet the Consortium's production standards. Though that's certainly not to say I'm irreplaceable. Anchor Egg is a particularly important mine. It may seem dramatic, but I'm convinced any failure here will result in my dismissal. It isn't easy for an outsider like myself to be accepted into a Telvani business, so yes, I'm a bit worried. It's routine, really. Whenever the Consortium believes a mine is operating below standards, they send along an auditor to run an inspection. This usually entails the Overseer providing a comprehensive tour of the Kwama pens and the mine's queen. Olfengar. I've met him once before, back when the mine was first opened. Nordfellow. Tough as rocks and sweet as salt, but a hard worker. You want that in an Overseer. To be honest, I'm surprised he's late. It's definitely out of the ordinary. I haven't the faintest idea. I was only sent along to conduct an audit. Though the Consortium did seem rather on edge. They said I should expect to hear all sorts of excuses, from cave-ins to cultists. <laughs> Laughable, I know, but it's part of the job. I shouldn't jump to conclusions, especially when I haven't had the chance to assess anything yet. But, yes, my employers certainly seem to think so. After all, not every worker keeps their company's best interests in mind.
expected more activity in the mine, but... Oh, by the green! What happened here? Fomesa, is she? Oh, no. alive? Let's hurry. Now you are a welcome sight. Please tell me the way out of here is clear. We were starting to lose any hope of escape. Sure as bones. I ask for aid and they send an auditor. At this rate there won't be a mine left to audit. I'm Overseer Ulfengar. The egg tenders behind me are Molsa and Barlock. We barely managed to escape the Quama, let alone those damned cultists. Yes, I sent word days ago asking for more guards. We first saw them sneaking around the mine, but now they've broken in somewhere near the hatchery. They've whipped the Quama into a frenzy, and I'm worried they're trying to poison the clutch. Fomessa went looking for survivors down the southern ramp, and egg tender Gain left to scout the southeastern passageways for a way out. I ended up here with Marsa and Barluk. If there are others alive out there, you'd know better than me. Oh, Fomessa. She was hard as steel, and twice as sharp. If she didn't make it, that doesn't bode well for the rest of us. Can you find Gain? He made his way towards the mess cavern not too far from here. One of the egg hands, Gain, noticed young Quama returning to their pins with green slime. A few days later, we started spotting cultists skulking about. What better way to poison a clutch than to taint the young ones? But there has to be more to it. There are plenty other mines across the peninsula. Killing this brood would only be an inconvenience to the Consortium. But yet the cultists are here in full force. I'm certain there must be more to their plan, but I have to look out for the miners. Wait, who are these people? And what are they doing to this mine? Thank <laughs> you. 
From my notes, I think this is... was Gain, one of the chief egg hands. with you. on the pen. Let's see what it says. the source of this frenzy? This poor hive. Any more? I need some tea.
The afflicted Thykor has proven most effective. It has made short work of this egg mine. Gods, all this destruction, all this suffering. Why are they doing this? My putrescent blade! they've done to her. The mine is dead without its queen. Perhaps we can still harvest her pheromone gland? Thank you. The consortium may be able to rebuild the hive with that. Poor thing. That's everything. Let's head outside. The overseer and the others should have made it out by now. Overseer, I'm glad you all made it out. With your expertise in the Queen's pheromone gland, we should be able to reopen the mine in... Reopen the mine? After the Consortium left us to die? To soften God with this mine. You've got the Queen's gland, requeen the mine yourself. We're leaving. Orfengar, please reconsider. Orfengar? Friend... Can you please if Sindith had wandered in here alone and gotten herself killed, how long before the Consortium sent another to find us? A day? A week? We're lucky someone of your metal was nearby. You have my thanks, friend. Truly. It failed the moment those Consortium hawkers chose to ignore my letters. Does Sindiath really think a queen's gland and some elbow grease will be enough to put that place to rights? You saw what those cultists were doing. It's blighted. Finished. So it's my burden, then. Shaw's bones. Those bastards are just greedy enough to risk it, aren't they? With a fresh queen's gland. Bah! No, we'd need an army of egg hands, alchemists, a staffed garrison. The consortium would never agree to it. Hm. Well, I guess we'll find out. Let me see this gland. And tell Sindith we'll stay on if the consortium provides all the staff and resources I need. The moment they hedge, I'm leaving. And taking Malsa and Barlak with me, Necrom be damned. That sounded like it went well. Please tell me you have some good news. I really need something to soften the blow of this report to my superiors at the Consortium. Oh, trust me, I'll make sure the Consortium does what is right. To send an auditor in place of soldiers? Unbelievable. 
The safety of the people of Necrom is my highest priority. Take my thanks, and everything that I owe you. Good. You can start by making sure the families of those lost in the mine are properly taken care of. Of course. Honoring those lost is the first step towards making things right. The first of many. <laughs>